What is Distributed Ledger Technology, DLT? Distributed Ledger Technology, DLT, is one of the fastest growing tech sectors in the world. While most people consider the terms blockchain and DLT as interchangeable, this is not the case. In fact, blockchains are just one small portion of the DLT sector. Importantly, a distributed ledger is a database that exists in duplicate across multiple points of a network. As the name suggests, the main characteristic of these networks is their decentralization. Consequently, all DLTs contain the technological infrastructure and associated protocols required to run a distributed network. These processes include the ability to collect, validate, and access immutable data across several nodes of the same network. How Distributed Ledger Technology Works DLTs can function in many different ways. However, all DLTs rely on some form of consensus to confirm the state of the network. A consensus mechanism is a protocol that allows network participants to validate the network's state. In terms of blockchain distributed ledger technology, the most common forms of consensus mechanisms are the proof of work, POW, and the proof of stake, POS, systems. Both of these mechanisms accomplish the task, albeit through different means. In a POW system, network nodes compete to solve a complex mathematical equation. The first node to complete the equation gets to add the next block to the blockchain. This process is very secure, but it does require intensive electrical usage. These high energy demands led developers to seek viable alternatives. In a POS system, computers still compete to add the next block, but in a different manner. Users validate blocks utilizing a staking mechanism. Staking is the act of placing your coins in a synchronized network wallet. The nodes with the most coins and the longest staking times are more likely to get to add the next block of transactions and receive the reward. Benefits of Distributed Ledger Technology The benefits of DLT are too immense to ignore. DLT networks provide a transparent and secure method for businesses and individuals to conduct true peer-to-peer -peer commerce. These systems provide effective management of dynamic data at levels that were unimaginable just a few years prior. Trustless Nature DLTs are a huge upgrade over centralized systems for many reasons. For one, these networks supply an immutability and transparency record of all transactions. In a public DLT, anyone can go into the network and verify what transactions transpired. This openness affords users more confidence. Secure Alternative Decentralization underpins the whole concept of a DLT. These networks are more secure because they remove any centralized attack vector. In a DLT network, the risk shifts from one centralized target over to thousands of smaller vectors. Since these smaller nodes don't possess vast amounts of valuable assets such as a central governing authority, they are less likely to experience a major attack. Additionally, DLTs utilize high-tech security to ensure their network remains pure. Nodes that enter malicious false data get expelled from the network immediately. This strategy helps to streamline the entire consensus process. Cost Reduction The trustless nature of DLTs make them an attractive alternative for firms seeking a secure network solution. DLTs such as blockchain networks eliminate the need for third-party verification systems. Since each of these systems add more costs and time to each transaction, eliminating them increases efficiency significantly. Companies understand the peer-to-peer -peer nature of these networks make them more affordable to run than a centralized system. Differences between blockchain and DLTs As of recently, the terms blockchain and DLT seem to have been muddled. 
Understanding the differences between these terms is an important step in becoming a more informed investor. Think of blockchain as only a tiny section of the distributed ledger sector. Importantly, not all DLTs are blockchains. In fact, DLTs have been around for centuries, long before the first computer ever existed. Additionally, not all blockchains are decentralized, but they are DLTs. Centralized blockchains utilize a network of nodes, but they rely on a central authority for the final transaction verification. These systems are more popular within traditional financial systems because they enable the centralized party the ability to alter and correct transactions where necessary. It's worth your time to study up on the exact differences. In this way, entrepreneurs and business leaders can determine which solution best fits their strategy.